about time. Sounds great, Roberta. Yes. Uh, this is the part we've all been waiting for. John Milligan is continuing his series now on traffic shortcuts this morning. His latest tip is on how to avoid the bottleneck around the inbound Eisenhower feeder ramp. Let me introduce you to the engineering marvel of the 20th century. It's this ramp that leads you to the inbound Eisenhower. From four lanes, you're pushed into one lane. It's not going to work. I don't know what the engineer was thinking. My quest in this series has been to save you a little time, get you into wherever you want to go a little bit quicker. And this one's so great because it's so simple, a simple solution to a simple problem. If this is where you started, this is where you should have stayed. Roosevelt Road, good old Route 38, it is a great shortcut. It can get you around the bottleneck and then you re-enter the Eisenhower at Mannheim or go all the way in and re-enter at Austin. Either way, when the time is 40 minutes from Mannheim to the post office, you'll save upwards of 15 to 20 minutes. The choice is yours, either Roosevelt Road with a couple of stoplights or this mess. There is one more reason why I like this shortcut. Try doing this on the Eisenhower. For Shadow Traffic, John Milligan, Channel 5 News. He's always doing something, isn't he? Tomorrow, our special report continues with tips on how to shorten your trip behind the wheel going to Great America. And we also want to point out that John did leave us a special tape. This is how to avoid Lakeshore Drive problems during the construction. You go east of the drive, you miss all the construction, you get a little wet, but see it's clear sailing. Not an obstacle between you and where you're going. Bob, are you pushing this through the city council or something? I'm I mean, going to talk to really, the mayor. You're yes. really hitting on this one. 616.